It's Anne. She's married Henry Percy. Wedded and bedded without telling anyone. You... you don't look pleased. Why would I be pleased? Well, it will make her the future Duchess of Northumberland. Our sister. George, they'll never allow it. He's already pre-contracted to marry Talbot. If this gets out, it will damage her. Her reputation will be ruined. I have to tell father, for her own protection. What were you thinking? The marriage of a senior noble is a matter of the state. Something only the king can decide. Who else knows about this? No one. Good. Well, that's how it will remain, forever. But you cannot undo what has been done before God. And consummate, too. There have been improper intimacies. I've lain with my husband. There's nothing improper about it. By God, if you are my daughter! The boy will return to Northumberland where he will marry the Talbot girl, as arranged. You will be sent to France and stay there until you've learnt your lesson. What? No! Father, please! How can you have done this? You knew full well Mary's friendship with the King is at an extremely delicate stage. Any scandal, any mark upon her name could be fatal. You will be sent to join the court of the French Queen and stay there until your father has forgiven you. You told them, didn't you? It was for your own good. And you never would have got away with it. It would have ruined your prospects forever. Really? For my good? Well, I'll try to remind myself of that while I'm in exile. And you're here in the king's bed, not challenged for our father's affection. That it was for my good, not yours. Anne! 